Some new information has just been released that allegedly we will be receiving a new XXX Tentacion song this Friday. Now this is insane for X fans, so make sure you watch this full video until the end because I will also be sharing news about a new XXX Tentacion album as well. You will need to hear all of this information. Leave a quick like on the video and subscribe to the channel if you are an XXX Tentacion fan. Now some very good news has just been released involving XXX Tentacion with some brand new music and apparently a new album. Now allegedly, one of his music vaults actually were found by somebody close with X, which actually held a lot of new X music. And with all of this new music, not only will we be receiving some new singles, but now we will even possibly be getting a new X album as well, which I couldn't even be more excited about because now this is kind of like the official return of XXX Tentacion in the year 2020. I couldn't be any more excited. Now a Twitter user who goes by the name Carson actually made a tweet just yesterday at the time of this recording saying this and I quote, XXX Tentacion in Wi-Fi's funeral, Mannequin 01 on all streaming platforms on Friday. Now, in case you are wondering, this Twitter user actually is a very reliable source for many things in the hip hop industry. He's gotten many things correct in the past, so honestly, I don't doubt him in this tweet at all. Now, many people actually replied to this tweet saying there were also allegedly gonna be a song called Jug Walk releasing as well on the 31st of the last day of this month. Now, this is super exciting because now with all of this new XXX Tentacion music, this will now kind of hint towards a brand new album. Now how this will all play out with the new singles that are being released is these singles will be released as the new song Mannequin and allegedly Jug Walk as well. This will now start to get X's name trending again. People will start bringing hype around his name again. His music will start going up in streams again gradually and then sooner or later we'll most likely be getting an album drop within the next few months or maybe even next month depending on how fast X's music label wants to have it released. Now something all fans of X should know about this possible new album is that you should be aware that this new album won't just be X on it. I know a lot of people watching this video may be fans of just the solo XXX Tentacion songs, kind of like I am personally, but most songs will have a feature on it as I'm pretty sure most of the songs that were found in this new music vault are mostly all unfinished songs and they're most likely just freestyles that X did in the studio. So he will have a pretty much a feature on all songs on the new album if it does continue to be released. Now make sure you continue watching this video because now this is the information that will need to be heard by all X fans. Now if this new XXX Tentacion album comes out this will be huge for X and especially his fans as it would be kind of XXX Tentacion's return to music in the year 2020 as I mentioned earlier. Now the song with Wi-Fi is a very good thing as well but in case you don't know the backstory Wi-Fi and X were actually very good friends before his sudden passing. So I know a song with X will mean the absolute world to Wi-Fi and just knowing Wi-Fi and you know kind of making videos on him in the past and being informed about his music career, I know 100% Wi-Fi is not going to let this song be a flop much like a lot of the other music that has been released before in the past for Wi-Fi. This song will be a 10 out of 10 production, it'll be mixed and mastered perfectly, and will not be rushed in any sort of way as some songs have with X in the past, especially after his passing. Now I am seeing many things online of people upset about this new X music releasing just because all of the drama that has been going on lately with his music since his passing. And in case you don't really know what I'm talking about, many fans don't even really claim X's music after his passing because of what his record label has pretty much been doing with it. 
So in case you are unaware, a lot of XXX Tentacion's recorded songs that he made before everything went down with him were actually sold to a lot of music artists after his passing for a quick profit which was absolutely horrible by whoever was in charge of it. I mean, it's absolutely disgusting to even really think about. A lot of X's pre-recorded music that was sold to a bunch of just random artists for a quick profit were artists that X didn't even really know. And this topic actually has been talked about a lot lately, especially by a lot of other big name YouTubers as well, which I won't say names of just in case they don't really want to talk about it in my video, but still, has been said a lot before. Now many fans are upset with the decisions that were made on XXXTentacion's behalf, but I am hoping that with this new person in charge with X's pre-recorded music, I think that it's going to go in a good way, and I don't think that his music, especially the new music that was found, will be sold for a quick profit. I think that this music will actually be put to good use. It'll be used to have artists come on it to feature on X's new songs that he actually knew, respected, and were friends with, just like the Wi-Fi situation with this new song coming out on Friday. I think this new song with Wi-Fi is a very good step in the right direction with making music with artists that XXXTentacion actually knew when he was still with us. So I am very happy with the new song that will be releasing with Wi-Fi, as it is kind of like his return to music, but I still kind of am in shock that a lot of XXXTentacion's good features that were pre-recorded all kind of went to waste as they were just sold to random artists around the world for a pretty quick profit for the music label and allegedly his family as well. I mean, this isn't really a new thing, but I still felt like I should bring it up in this video in case you kind of were one of those fans that were upset with a lot of the music that has been released by X within the last year with him being on some random music artist. That is pretty much exactly what happened. Now with XXXTentacion's last album, Bad Vibes Forever, many fans actually believed that that was going to be the last album we would ever receive from X, but that's simply just not the case. There will be many new XXXTentacion singles being released, it will just all be coming out within good time. So I mean, I don't know if you understand how a music label works, but XXXTentacion was signed to a music label. When you sign to a music label, you must release the amount of singles and albums that you signed to on your contract. So if X had, you know, four albums and maybe 22 single releases, whether he's with us or not, and if the songs are good or not, the music label will still just release random songs so they can make their money back from the signing bonus that they gave X originally. So I kind of hope that made sense a little bit because I tried to break it down as easy as possible. But XXXTentacion's record label knows they could be producing the last of his music that he ever recorded. They know they can't be releasing that out in bulk because yes, then they will run out of music very fast. But if they release the singles slowly and then they release a small album with all of those singles, that's honestly okay with me. Especially because we're also going to be getting the X documentary, which will be coming out soon. Pretty sure it should be coming out sometime within the next four months, I'm pretty sure. Or it could be even sooner at the time of this recording. Or it could even be released by the time somebody is watching this. If you are an XXXTentacion fan watching this video right now, honestly you shouldn't even really matter or care that much whether this music that now comes out in the future has features on it just because honestly to me any music that we can get from XXXTentacion is good music to me I mean he was my literal favorite music artist when he was with us so honestly any music I can really get from him I will take so hopefully this documentary will be good from X as well pretty sure it should be allegedly it's going to be over an hour long having a bunch of footage from behind the scenes of concerts behind the scenes of studio sessions and all kinds of things i honestly couldn't be any more excited for that as well and i hope you guys are too but 
I am going to be wrapping up the video. If you are watching to this point, make sure you let me know down below in the comments. And anyways guys, has been District Trending. Make sure you leave a like on the video if you haven't already, and subscribe to the channel if you're new.